Hi, my name is Johnny Young, and I am a Habitat homeowner in Atlantic Beach, Florida. I have been a homeowner since 2007. When I first applied to the program, I was really homeless. I had left my domestic situation due to domestic violence and um, really left with nothing but a van full of stuff and a bunch of kids and a little bit of money in the bank. Habitat was there for me at the right time and just greatly changed my life and my quality of life. I think home ownership probably means something a little different for Habitat homeowners than it does for your standard homeowner. It has given me a sense of owning something that is mine and um, I've never had anything that belonged to me. It's life changing. It's a blessing. This affects my kids in a positive way. They see their mother as a provider. Um, we're in a home. Being in this house has meant the world to me. Like my, I can't even explain it. Like I have a peace of mind knowing that this, this house belongs to me and my children. In my Habitat home, I felt safe. And my children felt safe. And that is, I know, one of the biggest things of parents. It has laid a very good foundation for my kids to be able to set themselves up, either for education or for their life after school or for their life when they can't live in my house anymore. Um, I don't intend to sell my house ever. I intend to pass it on to my children so they can continue to build on the wealth that Habitat has helped lay for me. It is a common misconception that Habitat is just giving away houses, and that is not what the program is about. I had to put in 300 hours of sweat equity, and what that means is you have to work. They don't just give it out. You have to work for it, and that make you appreciate it. I did everything in my house. I did the dirtiest jobs to the easiest of jobs. So I was a full-time working mom that was nursing a baby and trying to build a house and trying to clean up my credit so I could qualify. So it was a lot. Was I tired? Exhausted. Was it worth it? Every single bit. This was <clears throat> laying the path for my future, for the future of my children. I'm not a crafty person, like hammering and all that. I usually don't know sweat outside now, because that heat and all that, I don't usually do that. But knowing that this is going to be our house, and I said each time I was hammering that nail, I'm thinking, God, this is ours. It make you feel good. Habitat is all about breaking the cycle of poverty. Its goal is to educate homeowners so they're successful and give them a, a safety net so they won't lose their home to unforeseen circumstances. We had to go through, um, I think it was six weeks of training on how to budget your checkbook, how to keep a balance. They provide us little programs where people came in and taught us how to manage our money, to save our money, how important credit was. My credit score now is extremely high as it can even go. I've learned so much on how to balance my money, and Habitat did that for me. They had a workshop program we had to go through that showed us how to unclog a toilet. They gave us information on every angle in our home, how to do little small jobs in the home, as like the toilets, things like that. We know everything about our homes, and Habitat teaches us all of that. They have a college program that homeowners can go to, and um, Shaddell Foundation, which is good for college, your family could go, your kids, and it's a great program, and they pay for everything 100%. I was able to go to college, uh, with the, uh, the grants and um, I was able to get my two-year associates in ophthalmology, which was my dream. Uh, yeah, I was a little turtle because I went to school in my 40s, but I was determined and I finished graduating with a 4.0 and valedictorian of my class. So it changed my life because I became somebody when before I felt like I was a nobody. And I, it would not have happened if it weren't because of being in a home of Beaches Habitat. 
When you go in another community, sometimes you buy a home, you don't know who your neighbors are. But you do get to know your neighbors when you're building and doing your, your, your hours of service. You get to know these people and you form relationships. And that's all about building a community, which is so much more important than just building a home. We got to know each other and we got to uh, become neighbors and then we became friends and now we're family and one person looks out for another person. They're a part of you. Just like the house, they are a part of you. We all attended the same workshops. We worked on each other's homes before ours were started. We worked on other people's homes who were already in the program, and we got to watch our house progress. You first look at the, at the empty lot, and you're like, oh my God, what on earth are they gonna build here? But then slowly but surely, it starts to take form. And you start seeing the walls and you start seeing the roof. And you're like, oh my God, this is becoming more and more of a dream. And then you see the windows come in. I'm sorry, because it's just... And finally, it, it's all put together. And it's yours. It was just overwhelming and just so much joy. We first came in, like after the walls were up and everything was done, we sat right here on this living room. We had no furniture in here. And we just sat here and just thank God for how he blessed us. We've come a long way. And we just sat here, and when I tell you, me and my children sat here and cried. Each part of this house, my kids helped build. Like each wall we put in, each room we put in, made it personal, and this is our house. You earned this. You build this. You spent your sweat earning this. And if you get a boo-boo and you cut yourself, now you've sweat and blood making this. So this house is not just a house. You are part of the house and the heart, this house is part of you. So no one can take this away from you. And this is not just a house. This is your home. If you ever go in front of my house and the walls come down, it's got my kids' handprints and my handprints in there. It says, made with love with Beaches Habitat. I know that I am surrounded by pieces of wood that built were built into walls with the loving hands of people that cared about me and cared for me. And that means probably more to me than anything.